Hey, happy Halloween, everybody. Um, wanting to touch in a little bit with you guys to let you know. I'm going to get back to doing some more regular videos. Taking a lot of time off because this is the busy, crazy time of the year for psychic mediums. <clears throat> um, first off, <laughs> we are being bombarded by you guys uh, from seeing paranormal activity. The veil is thinner right now. It is, of course, Halloween, and a lot of people like to get readings. Uh, a lot of those kind of activities go on with it. <clears throat> but for the most part, the veil is thin, and you guys are seeing a lot of paranormal activity. Um, I have one little old lady in 86 that has got traffic going through her house, and she's afraid to tell anybody because they think she's nuts. I saw it, okay? I saw it. <laughs> um, I have a 15-year-old girl who is talking to um, a companion. Paranormal activity is high right now. <clears throat> I did say all along that you guys would, your intuitions would um, increase and ramp up over a period of time. And it's just the way we are evolving. And nobody's, I don't hear anybody else touching base on this. Um, as a human uh, race, that is how we are evolving. Uh, to be more intuitive. At some point, I can give you this message strictly telepathically. And not have to convey it this way. And you can, you'll get it. Um, but one thing I want to talk to you guys about is, please do not call us. Uh, psychic mediums, psychics, mediums, shaman. Um, if you have dabbled with the occult and have activity going on, you may not know it. Um, tarot cards are, you're opening a portal when you use tarot cards. You're opening a portal when you use pendulums. You're opening a portal any time you use anything for divination. And that is communication to the other side. And a lot of you are kind of messing around with some of that stuff and you're not um, kind of properly trained and you're not getting, you know, you, you tried it once, put it away and forgot all about it. Man, that might have even been 10 years ago. Well, at a time like this when the energy is so much easier for them to cross back and forth. Um, sometimes things will start happening. <clears throat> so, do not play with those things. Um, I often relate to um, divination. You have to be able to direct your question to God. Beings of the light which are God, that's God, okay? And if you don't direct your message to that direction, to God and, and who you want your letter to go to, it could go anywhere. It's like last call in the bar. And... You're the you're the old you're the old ugly girl left at last call. And I and and just for fun, I happen to say, who wants to have sex? You know the low life over in the corner that's already drooling, who will raise his hand and, and oblige me. But that again is just a low vibe energy in both cases. Okay. So um, be careful with what you're playing with right now. Um, caution, use uh, a lot of caution or don't do it at all. You know, uh, that leave it to the people to do it. And I can give you the names of um, several other girls that have been working with me throughout the summer. Um, but please don't. <laughs> Don't be... And you know what another thing is go, that goes on this time of the year, too? The Christians 
turn absolutely evil. They do. Oh, man, they come at us with guns and knives and, man, uh, uh, just they, uh, with teeth bared. They, they, just this time of the year, the, the Christians, not all, you know, I'm not pointing fingers at all of them. I was one, was once myself. Um, but they just get it driven in their head about what the, the Bible says about demons and, um, the occult. Um, and again, you know, why not, you know, why everybody should not do that. Um, classic example. Uh, I kind of ran off stray there. Um, yeah, I'm going to be getting back to doing some uh, regular videos real soon. It, I am totally drained. Um, hanging out in bed. It's not even uh, 8 o'clock at night. And I'm hanging out just watching some football. Um, I am busy clearing energies, casting out ghosts, um, doing all the Halloween readings and the, uh, the balls and events that are in the area. And I am just about tapped out. Tapped out, especially with the uh, paranormal activity. Um, you know, I've got a scared little old lady um, in fear of her life. Um, only because she doesn't know what they are. And... It is even scary for me when my sons come to me and I'm not totally certain it's them at first. Um, <clears throat> so it will startle you if you see a shadow or, or a figure and you don't know who it is. So, you know, expect to see that as, as time goes and as things ramp up for you guys. Um, Try not to communicate with them if you don't want to. If you do connect with an, an, an apparition, or if one happens to stay, kind of hover over you or a shadow, um, handle yourself like you would with anybody else on the street. If you feel comfortable enough to say hello, say hello. If you don't, that's okay. Go on about your business and let them go too. All right, hope that didn't scare the bejesus out of you. All right, um, yeah, happy Halloween, you guys. I am going to go ahead and get um, a couple more videos out for you real soon here. And I just wanted to let you know that I'm alive and well, okay? Love you guys. See you soon.